it's very difficult finding a tree right here, but we did find a white oak that's kind of a little bit too close to the trail, but we're gonna try to make it happen. We can shoot pretty much everything we need to cover right in this area, so we should be able to make it work. What is it? There's a deer out there better than the field. Alrighty guys, we just went up on top of this hill, we pulled our trophy rock, we pulled the camera card. Um, we're pretty much getting everything ready to go, so when we get back from Colorado, we're gung-ho and ready to kill a big buck, so. Alrighty guys, we just got up here to our food plot we planted two weeks ago. We wanted to pull this mineral rock out of here and switch out the cards. And if you get a good look at this food plot, we got a solid board germination throughout the whole thing, so everything looks great. The plot's a little good moisture and get plenty of sunlight. We pulled one of the cameras <coughs> that we had on one of our earlier summer spots and we're moving it to this trailer that's right in front of our stand. It looks like it's being heavily used and we just want to monitor it, monitor it for the next couple weeks before season and then we'll pull the card a couple days before season to help decide where we're going to sit opening day in here. It's definitely going to be on this property, we're just not sure which set yet. So I'm just going to set this up quick. Well guys, we found a natural scrape here already with a licking branch over it and it's right in front of where we just hung our stand right here on this edge where they're coming out of the corn. Um, it can't get much better than that for a perfect scenario. We have a perfect tree to hang stand right here, right on the edge. Scrape right in front of it, food source, bedding. We're gonna get out of here. All right, we're going in here and getting this last stand hung. It's gonna be a double set. We have a couple of the sticks already up and uh, we got some ratchet straps in the back. All right, I just finished this set. It's a double set, it's really high. I gotta do a little bit of lane trimming. I have to bring the pole saw in next time I come in here, but this one's ready to go. It's a little different, it's a field edge. It's kind of on an outside corner, but the deer are coming out over here about 50 yards in front of me on this side and they're also coming out on this side from the scouting so we're trying to cut that in half and we're kind of just hoping for the first couple of days here have to try this stand for luck and then if it doesn't happen the first few days we'll get some scouting out of for next year this is a new property so there's nothing wrong with getting some eyes on this new property so like I said early season that's where we're gonna be probably right here and then we're gonna hunt this hard the first week and then we're gonna back right out here and we're gonna hunt our stands a little bit deeper in the woods here come rut. Hey guys, thanks for watching our summer scouting video. We've been really hard at work this summer here and we've been hanging stands and scouting deer and trying new tactics, trying new properties. We're trying to hone in on some nice deer, Tyler, myself, and Darton. We've all got some nice deer on camera. I know George always has good deer every year. Jared also has some nice deer on camera. He's got some nice hit listers for the kids. So things are looking really good for us this year and we're really excited. We're sorry we couldn't make the show. We're actually in Colorado now as you watch this trying to put down some elk. So it's a good time. Um, I was here last year and I absolutely loved it. So we cannot wait to hopefully show you guys, you know, what we can put down and regardless what we put down, just the fun we have. So. Don't forget to buy your Flatland Whitetails Bash tickets while you're here. It's going to be October 8th. We hope to see it. It's just going to be a good time hanging out, you know, eating, listening to some music, talking, hunting. There'll be other people there, some booths, the game commission. It's just going to be an all around good time. This will be our first year doing it. And then next year, we hopefully evolve it into a 3D archery shoot with Up in Arms. So keep posted on that. 
and uh, see where this thing goes. So, hey, good luck this season, guys, and everyone take care.